Well, hello everybody, and welcome back to my playthrough of Tales of Vesperia, and I completed the, uh, I'm, well, material farming I needed from that new area that just unlocked last episode, so I'm going to make my way to Dongrass and, and just try and make some new equipment upgrades. Also, there's some side stuff I can actually do around here. Let's start here. Yeah, I managed to make it get enough scorpion tails. Let's see, try to remember all the things that I can I need to make. I didn't get to last time. Oh yeah, Bahamut's tier. Now that I got scorpion tails and crystals, I got a little bit extra. Just in case. Oh yeah, I still need some materials for the gun mirror. Oh yeah, now I can actually make make Monier plus one alpha. There we go. Don't have to worry about. Don't need to worry about unicorn horns. Oh, I can finally make the star rod for Estelle. Using my one light star gem. I'll have to figure out where the enemy that drops that is. Someday. Alright, so... Hmm. That. Oh, there's some new upgrades here for Death Slingers. I'll. Oh, wait, I can actually make these Falcon Needles. Alright, these are new. So. Hmm. I might as well make an extra Death Slinger just in case. I'm gonna have to... Wait, I don't have to. Hmm. Let's see for... Actually, I can make a set... Oh, I'm gonna need it. another Light Star Gem to make a new Sonic Cleaver. Well... I guess I can make an extra Sonic Cleaver to get the... Oh yeah, this required a Dark Star Gem. I don't know who drops that, but... <clears throat> oh, the Orochi plus one, I can... Oh, I can actually... Hmm, should I go resist or defend? I think I'll go... Plus two Alpha? I see if there's any more for for a key. Nope. Oh, a new weapon for for Patty the Scorp Scorpia. I never knew that was a available, but all right, let's make these Caprias. Oh, I could use a Mercurius. Now I can make the Mercurius plus one. Wow, just being able to get a lot of different weapons. Alright, the Casgar is still a while away. So is the Karn thing. As is the Swordbreaker. But I can finally make the Crystal... Well, the crystal heals for Judith. Oh, and new, new piece of equipment, the Beast King. 
I'm going to have to get a hippo breath for... Well, for repeat, but... Ooh, wait a minute. Hmm, this... This might be worth it just for treasure things. Ancient ribbon. Hmm. Still need some giant, giant aphids. Hmm, resist. All right. Hey, kid. Huh. Wow. Who knew I could get so many more upgrades? But I am definitely going to have to farm for more. I'm gonna put Bahamas here on Yuri. Still gotta work on Zephyrus. Wait a minute. I forgot to put a Hyperion on on a, on a Stell so I can get TP condition in TP condition too. Oh, I just realized I had a Mercurius already. I should have known better. I just wasted some money. All right, I can put the Crystal Heels on. On Judith. She's almost done with the Hanuman stack two, plus two alpha. Alright, there we go. And I think before I move on, I might as well get some rest. Yeah. Yeah, there's some side content I need to complete. Oh! Well, normally you just pass off by womanizing. Yeah. Well, the blast here, that is his heart. Huh. Well, you had it inside you for a long time. Yeah. Hmm. I mean, you've been living with it for a decade now, so I imagine you st you're comfortable living with a plasti in your heart. But kind of think of it, if we go through this, go through with this plan, Raven won't be around anymore. At no way. And I remember the Blastia runs off of his life force. Huh. Huh, you alright, Raven? I'm guessing... Uh, I'm guessing his Blastia is starting to run out of strength. But I think I want to try and visit the... Well, visit the guild next. Oh, hey. How's it going? Well, I'm sure you'll figure something out. Hey. And what about you all the way back here, sir? Oh, what guild? Uh, sure, why not? Okay. Oh, the bunny guild! Okay. Oh, what kind of badge? Oh, so the more titles I get, the more rewards I get? All right, and I get girl bunny ears and the bunny guild badge. The bunny girl ears are for for Estelle, obviously. Well, how many? Get full frame glasses. Hmm. 
Hmm. Well, I still need to collect more. Alright, so I think it's time to move a bit further along. I mean, I got as many upgrades as I can actually get. I think I know where I want to go next. That's Aspiel. Ah, uh, hey Rita. Oh. Yeah, if if you think that'll help us. Mm -hmm. Yeah, might as well make use of the knowledge while while it's available. But now Rita's left us. Might as well head deeper into Aspio and see... See what we can get. Oh, Yeah. Mm-hmm. Yeah. Well... You're gonna have to figure out a way to do so, I mean... Rhea's not exactly gung-ho about this plan either. But, if it's to save the world and stop the apocalypse, yeah. Hmm. Yeah, now it'll just be Blastia history instead of how to use Blastia. Hmm. Uh, yeah, they tend to think they know what's best. I know I'm gonna be up there much sooner than I... Eventually. I'm kinda getting there now. Yeah. Alright. And read us back. Hey. Mm -hmm. I don't know. You probably don't want to draw any of the breakers. I mean, you seen what happened in Nor when Nordopolica decided to run up? Well, increase the power of theirs. Hey, how's it going? Hmm. Oh yeah, Fortune's Market. I'm trying to remember if there's something else I could do here. Oh. Guess so. Oh, what book? Estelle, were you... Oh, the collector's book. Of course. Mm-hmm. Yeah. I mean, we're about more than halfway through. Well? Uh, Estelle, we're not done with it yet. Yeah, that's her girlfriend. Leave her alone. Yeah. It's not done. Yeah. I mean, you wouldn't want to read a book when it's only halfway done, would you? Of course. Alright. Oh, Giovanni. You're not going to use this to help Team Rocket, are you? Hmm. 
I mean, we already been helping out murderers and such. So. So it's not like. It's not like Brave Vesperia has clean hands, I would say. Alright, so now that that scene's done. Oh, there was something I was supposed to do here. Yeah, let me go back. Turns out I was supposed to spend some time at the end. Yeah. Yeah, I think it's supposed to be at least a couple of times. I'm trying to look up the answers as I go. Alright, my... Hey. Yeah. What? You find something useful? Ooh, pretty. Yeah, it's like fireworks. Wait, magic using spirits, so... Well, that's fantastic. Mm-hmm. Alright. Oh, so because glassy are made from apatheia and they become spirits. Oh. Yeah, what? Oh. You're probably not going to stop Rhea from being curious. Well, yeah. Just ignore that she's in a party full of people who aren't from Aspio. Yeah. Mm-hmm. Yeah, if you can't study one thing, you can always study... Uh, well, study an another thing. I kind of stuttered there. Hmm. Yeah. Alright, let's see. Whoa! Really using a yo-yo as a... Wow! Rita, you might want to stop. We don't want the town to collapse. Yeah. Save it for some monsters. Oh. What? Yeah, I mean, Rhea's already mastered it, so... Oh. Okay. Well, I can think of a place where you can use it. And Rita's learned Meteor Storm. Yeah, that's why I wanted to try and finish that part off. And let me just... Yeah, let's leave Aspio. I there's like there's a couple more spots for me to. Hey, it's raining out here. I wonder if I should see if there's any particular enemies that pop out in the rain. And it doesn't look like it. So I think I'll just head along and... Let's see. There's a couple places I need to go. Should be able to see... Oh, there we go. Oh, come on! I wanted to go into Miorzo. 
But no, you had to... There we go. Had to make sure it said enter instead of climb down. Ugh. Alright, the one thing... One of the things I... I don't like about... F about mm, using a dragon as an airship. Can't enter a flying town. Yeah, but there is someone I need to visit. Uh, hey, Elder. Well, uh, yeah. Ah. Oh. Yeah, we're evolving them. Yeah, it's... It's an idea we come up with. I'm hoping it works out. Yeah, hopefully. One would hope. Oh, so if I'm going to integrate with the rest of the world now? I mean... <laughs> oh, yeah. Not quite yet. Oh, okay. Yeah. Alright. Hmm. Maybe Yorngin? Maybe try and rebuild that? Yeah, I mean, we have... Well, we have the one in Aspio. Mm-hmm. Yeah, you know, just go with the flow. It's kind of how Judith spin. Whether it's battle or, or when it comes to Raven. I mean, I could do the other two dragon races, but I don't, I don't know how well that would go, considering how they didn't go so well when I, when I was trying levels one through three. I mean, there is something I can get for it, but... I'm not sure if that's worth my... <sighs> or I can make the effort worth it. Wait a minute. Pharaoh? What are you doing flying around here? Flying. I don't know. Idiot could come along and take him out. He couldn't put up a fight like this. Yeah, and with Autofago sending down. It's probably so humans won't get his apatheia. Oh, okay. Human well. greed knows no bounds. Even the sky offers no sanctuary. Well, you really think so? Then there really isn't anywhere that's safe. Hmm. Well, we'll find him. Pharaoh. Hey, <laughs> he's landing. Yeah. It looks like he's calling us. Yeah, maybe we should see what Pharaoh Let's wants. Go. Maybe he wants one final do with a Tim. Pharaoh? Pharaoh, come on! Oh man, it's all tuckered out. I'm sorry. It was all for us. Yeah. What do you mean? Pharaoh was a decoy for us at Zaude. Yeah, and that took a lot out of him. The fate of the world is set. We shall meet our end. Duty unfulfilled. How unfortunate. Well, what if I told you there was a way where you could still fulfill your duty, even if you're not here? You give up pretty fast for someone who fought for so long. Yeah. Sorry, but things aren't over yet. Yeah, leave it to us. Zal is lost. The Adefagos has returned. Neither humans nor we possess the power of old. Alone we may not, but together we could. What more can be done? Uh, we could turn you into a spirit. There's still hope. There's a new power. Yeah, we just discovered it. We would like you to become a spirit. A being that can control air even more. Yeah. But to do that, we need your apatheia. 
Yeah, so you kind of had to pass along to the next life so we can kind of bring you back in spirit. You ask me to hand over my life. Well, yes, we we do. It's we don't want to. <sighs> Your heart alone cannot save the world, but you must have the heart to save it. Well, we do. I am not long for this world. Do with me as you please. <sighs> well, goodbye, Pharaoh. Gonna miss you. And Pharaoh becomes an apophea. Well, Rita. Can I need you to do your thing. What if he doesn't help us when he becomes a spirit? He will. Pharaoh loves the world. It'll be fine. Yeah. And once we convince him Belias is Undine, that might help him even more. Shall we? We shall. But the air crane here is all dried up. Hmm, if well. I follow the flow of the air back, I should be able to pull it from within the world. Oh, so you think you can do it from here? Are you sure? I mean, we say we say Nicados is nearby, is but telling me that. Ah. Oh. Okay. All right, let's do it. I just remember to do sucked up all the air from there. Oh, we say Nicados, but. Ho ho ho! It worked. So, so we have. Hey, hey, hey. Hot, hot, hot. Makes sense that fire spirit would be in the desert. The spirit of fire. Yeah. I feel unlimited power. Ah, feeling good again, Pharaoh. Oh yeah, and this is Undine. Such consideration. Pelias? So you too have Yeah, that's what we were hoping to try and tell you with your well before you passed, but I am now called Undine, the ruler of the waters. Mm-hmm. I have changed form. So I too require a new name. Alright, so what did Pharaoh evolve into? You who have reincarnated me. Give me a name. Alright, Estelle, what kind of name should we name Pharaoh now? The fearsome fiery fireball king! Uh, Carol, you don't get to name the spirits. That's Estelle's job. Such a powerful, terrible fire. The blazing one, Efreet. Alright. Efreet sounds pretty good. I am now connected strongly to the world. And all seems new again. Mm-hmm. Yeah. Land is filled with power. <laughs> Wonderful. You know, if you weren't a, a benevolent being, your evil actor would be pretty good. Hey, he flew away. Mm-hmm. Hey, yeah. where are you off to? Yeah. Fear not. We are bound to you. Wherever you go, we are with you. All right, so a free. Part of our group now. The Intelikea and the child of the full moon bear spirits. Mm-hmm. Nature's providence is great indeed. Yeah. Well, later on, ending. Man, they are so different before and after becoming spirits. Yeah. They're... It's more that they're different from each other. They have totally different points of view. It's like... Imagine if a fish became a bird. Oh, someone who was swimming in the ocean suddenly became... Suddenly was able to fly. This is better for them than being some sage, always worrying about the world. Mm-hmm. Yeah, at least now they can do something about it. All right, and got a skit. You know, we're up to our eyeballs in problems. Saving the world sure keeps a guy busy. Well, the problems we're dealing with are a lot bigger than they used to be. 
What? Why is everybody looking at me? I got something on my face? Problems like you, Yuri. A lot. I hear that. Fate is definitely out to get you. <laughs> After everything that's happened, I'm starting to wonder myself. But hey, I've done a pretty good job of getting us out of whatever mess we're in, right? You gotta at least give me some credit there. See, for Yuri, the end of the world's just one more problem that needs solving. Maybe that yeah. attitude's what's kept us seeing the light at the end of the tunnel. Gotta love the power of positive thinking. Mm-hmm. Yeah, that's pretty good. And come to think of it, I think I really need to call it an episode. There's really very little that I need need to do now. Hmm, well there's some materials I can gather. But I think what I want to do is, in between episodes, I need to look up what materials I need to get. Hey, this area right here I never knew was available. This looks easy. One shot should. All right, we got a new enemy, the gentleman. I'm gonna assume we can get gentleman's ties from him. Remember to keep a sharp eye out. All right, and with that, Judas learned life up. All right, and never skit. We're lucky Pharaoh decided to help us out. He's a little extreme, but there's no doubt he cares for this world, just like Judy said. I've been hard on him in the past, but he has helped us out all this time. We must defeat the Autophagos and save the world for Pharaoh and his love of the world. Ah, uh, no cheesy lines. Yeah, come on! Honestly, you two should learn to show your feelings. Yeah, well, showing feelings isn't exactly a... Well, a strength that any of us have. But... Oh, I was wanting to check that corner. Don't get my magic There we go. Damn it. There we go. Oh, they do drop gentlemen's ties. That's why I wanted to check. And yeah, I think in between episodes I'm gonna check in. Well, what I meant to say is, I want to check the, I'll check the shots for synthesis and see what materials I need to get before the next series of upgrades. But hey, they got Emmys here at nighttime. Let's have a good time. All right, and we got a gentle golem. All right, thirty thousand HP. <laughs> kind drives the central bone head. Oh, they have Blasium War J! That was one of the materials I've been trying to look for. So, looks like I'll be farming here for a bit. So, until next time, I want to thank you for watching and I hope you have a good day. So, until then, stay safe, be kind to each other, and treat others with love, care, and respect. Thanks, everyone.